CalBond offers a complete line of PVC coated conduit and fittings made exclusively at our state of the art facility in Santa Paula, California. With proper installation, one can expect a long lasting superior corrosion resistant system that requires little to no maintenance. We recommend using a chain vise for clamping PVC coated conduit. However, a yoke type pipe vise can be used as well. When using the chain vise, in order to protect the surface of the conduit, it is important to use CalBond half shell clamps. The clamps allow for a strong grip without damaging the exterior coating of the conduit. These half shell clamps are available in sizes half inch through six inch and can be purchased via your local CalBond sales distributor. Half shell clamps can be made using standard GRC conduit, one trade size larger than the PVC coated conduit you intend to clamp. Here we're using one inch GRC in order to prepare the half shell clamps for three quarter inch PVC coated conduit. Begin by clamping the GRC in the vise leaving about a foot of conduit on the end. Next, use a bandsaw to make a six inch lengthwise cut in the conduit. Make the cut slightly off center and then cut the conduit vertically to create two half shells, one smaller than the other. Now repeat the entire procedure so that you have four half shell clamps. Discard the larger pieces and use the two smaller pieces to protect the conduit in the vise. In order to properly clamp CalBond PVC coated conduit, place the half shell clamp around the conduit before inserting into the vise. You want to make sure that no part of the vise is directly touching the coated conduit. And make sure the chain vise is holding the conduit very tightly. If it is too loose, the conduit can slip, which may result in damaging the exterior coating. If a yoke type vise is to be used for clamping PVC coated conduit, it is recommended that the jaws assembly be replaced with CalBond vise adapters. These adapters spread the clamping force over a larger area, which helps prevent spinning of the pipe during cutting and threading. CalBond PVC coated conduit can be cut conventionally, manually, or with a power saw. We recommend using a roller cutter to cut smaller diameter coated conduit, one half inch to one inch. Above one inch, a portable electric band saw is recommended. After cutting the conduit, use a reamer to remove any rough edges. This ensures that the wire pulled through the conduit will not be damaged. CalBond conduit can be threaded using any standard threading tool. Before threading, a series of cuts should be made in the PVC coating, allowing the coating to be removed in small pieces instead of long strips that can foul the die head. Use a thread protector to gauge the length of the cuts and begin by making a slit up one side of the thread protector with a knife. Push the thread protector over the cut end of the conduit and with a knife, cut around the circumference of the conduit where the thread protector ends. This cut will indicate the starting point for the longitudinal cuts and it will give an even ending to the PVC coating that is removed during threading. Now remove the thread protector and make four to five longitudinal evenly spaced cuts around the conduit. And be sure to cut all the way through the coating to the metal. If the threading is going to be done with a hand threader, use the knife to trim off a small portion of the PVC coating at an angle all the way around the conduit. This enables the die teeth on the threader to engage the conduit. Before you begin threading, be sure that the conduit is tightly clamped and securely held in the vise. Now the conduit is properly prepared and can be threaded.
While threading, be sure to use a good quality thread cutting oil to aid in the threading and flush away the metal and PVC chips. After threading, use a degreasing spray to thoroughly clean the threads and the interior of the pipe. Degreasing is important in order to ensure that the thread compound will adhere to the unprotected steel. Once the thread area is cleaned, thoroughly apply Calbon threading compound to the exposed steel. The thread compound is available in both a spray can and brush on form. Calbond offers a complete line of standard, special, and large radius elbows ready for quick shipment. Our PVC coated conduit can be bent with any conventional bending equipment. When field bending is necessary, there are a variety of tools from which to choose. To accommodate the PVC coating when using a hand bender, always select the next larger shoe size. Use a Calbond hickey to reduce the possibility of damage to conduit coating when making sharp bends, saddles, and offsets. For optimal results, use equipment specially designed for bending coated conduit. Hydraulic and electric benders are available with shoes sized for Calbond coated conduit. When bending Calbon PVC coated conduit with powered equipment, use rubbing alcohol to clean the inside of the shoe and the area of the conduit to be bent. Never use a lubricant on the shoe of the conduit. Lubricants tend to allow conduit to slip above the center line of the shoe, resulting in flattening of the elbow. Calbond exterior touch-up compound is used to repair nicks cuts and abrasions to the outer surface of PVC coated conduit. For minor abrasions and cosmetic repairs, we have also developed a touch-up spray solution available in a 13 ounce aerosol can. Before applying the touch-up compound, be sure to thoroughly clean and dry the area to be patched. Once the area is cleaned, use emery paper to lightly sand the surrounding area Next, apply Calbon touch-up compound to the damaged area with a brush. Be sure to cover all exposed areas of conduit. Allow the compound to dry for two to four hours in between applying layers. For optimal results, allow the compound to dry overnight. Once the applied compound has completely dried, sand it down so the repair sits flush with the exterior coating of the conduit. To complete the repair, apply Calbon touch-up spray for an even finish. Thank you for watching Calbon's training program. The use of our quality tested procedures and custom design tooling will allow for a smooth and easy installation and result in a superior corrosion resistant system. For further information, feel free to contact one of our Calbon product specialists in our customer service department. Thanks.